Welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft Season 2 And today we're going to check out a few things I've built So let's head over to the farm first I have upgraded my farm I felt like I didn't need to show you building my farm since I did that all in Season 1 So I did it all off camera and I think this is even better than what we had And I think you'll enjoy it so right here we have the wheat and the pumpkin farms, and there's gate, of course. Then we have the sugar cane, and the sugar cane, unlike last season, is all automatic. You just step on this pressure plate, and it all flows toward you except for maybe one or two stray pieces, which is fine. You can deal with that. Then over here, I started a watermelon farm. It's, it's starting, it hasn't all grown yet, but there's progress there. And last but not least is our cacti farm. Same concept as the sugarcane, except for it completely annihilates it since uh, if we harvested it from the second level, we'd have the problem of all the cacti that fell straight downward would land on the cacti and disappear because when an object hits a cacti it disappears it's sad i know but it's good for making trash cans and stuff i haven't made one yet personally so let's head back and i'll show you the next next few things up we go, back to our house, <laughs> with the snow from my snow golem. Alright, so the first thing in here is not that exciting, it's just a very, very minor security system. It always opens the door, I don't like it. It just brings a block up to block any intruders that don't have a pickaxe. Uh, I also want to show you how I organize everything in case you're having problems with that. I have tools and weapons. I have everything wooden, rocks and metals, the other random stuff which is uncategorized things, minerals such as dirt, sand, and gravel is normally in there too, armor, and transportation. So boats, minecarts, and anything used to make armor, or the armor itself. Here are all my mod items. My foofy color box from the last season has made its return. I have lots of lapis in there. Everything food. All our food related items. And redstone and railways. It's a good sorting method I'd say. Alright, next is a secret chest. The idea isn't mine. I've modified it a bit though. So, there's a button here. And it doesn't do anything yet. But, when we place a sugar cane in each of these corners, and those will last five minutes, which is more than enough time, and you hit the button, it just appears for a second, so that you can get in the chest, and it'll close so that if you're on the server, and then anybody's looking at you, they won't know that you're reorganizing your chest. So, that's nice. Nice little contraption there. And then, take your things off the pressure plates in the corners, and it won't work anymore very nifty. I love it. I haven't done anything like it before, so I was happy to see a success. I'm not going to show the redstone wiring unless you guys ask me for it in the comments. Then I will show you. I think personally that stuff is boring and not for everyone. Alright, last but not least is our cobble generator over in this room. 
Uh, to keep it compact, I used the Red Power mod instead of actually using Redstone. Although I could have. Just for the credit. And you mine it, and it immediately comes back. It's a nice system. It pumps it forward and then starts pumping it up for you to mine at your ease. You can get cobble pretty fast and infinitely with this. And my pickaxe is broke, so that must be the end of this video. Uh, leave me a rating if you take a half a second to do that it'd be very much appreciated I need to get my channel rolling it used to be on a roll but now it's not I don't know where everyone went so leave that rating and thanks for